She's great. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. It's all good. Right? She's a golfer. It's awesome. So this lady did amazing by kind of learning how to build her grip right here. There's a face that's too strong, right? There's a face that's too weak. So from this position, so see how I'm kind of now I'm going to build my grip from there. I'm going to put my relaxed left hand on there, put my right hand on, let the club weigh into this, crook of my index finger. Now I'm in a place where I'm not, you know, shut, trying to figure out the downswing. You with me? Okay. So come on in here for a sec. Put the club in your right hand. Just kind of, because when you put it in your right hand, Matt, you're just going to get it to where you can dial it the, the face you want. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, so right hand only. Right hand, leave your left arm just kind of hanging. And so when we look at this, right, so this would be too open, right? And that would be about spot on, okay? okay. So now just kind of take a, look, take a look at what that looks like. Now reach over here and put your left hand on pretty passively where that's flattish. Awesome. Grip it. Now put your right hand on. Okay, nice. Really, really good. Okay. Now from there, just for funsies, okay, on three, two, one, hit or whiff a ball, go. Okay, perfect. Now come take a look. Let it just load up here. Because, I mean, you'll see what I'm talking about. You go, okay. And this is why, I like, golf camps. Good. Okay. So if I, yeah, I would, you know, obviously I'll let you, your, your shoulders got a little. You know, I, it's not it's not necessarily about trying to be perfectly in line. And honestly, I, would, I was just about to say I'd have you more tipped over. Okay, so you miss because you, you know, your shoulder pitch got a little flat. But let me put in your or first one of your first swings here. So here is that swing that we captured on gears, right? And when we go to the top, you know, you're going to start to see, so there's, you know, there's that very strong face. So it's steep and strong, right? So way, way different looking face position right here. Now the pitch of things is n I'm not crazy about because I wish I could reach into this screen and tip you, right, from like here to here. You know, just kind of tip your shoulder down and get you, like, to there, right? But you get my point, right? But now, tons. Yeah, you still got to kind of find the ball somehow. See what I mean? Yeah. But, like, this steep and strong, now you're, like, in dead. Like, that's dead. Dead, dead, dead. And so from there, now you're, now you're strong, and now you got to back out of it and add loft. And that's what well, that's the that's the move that I don't all you're gonna do when you get older is hate golf if we don't fix this now. And I want you to like golf and you're gonna be really good at golf. Because now you can send me a video once a week. Hey Martin, how's this look? And I'll be like, way to go. You know what I mean? It takes a little you'll see it's a fist bump or whoa. You see you got off the rails. So build that grip again right there. Yeah, put a ball in front of you. Okay. Okay. Right hand only. Just right, yeah. Grab it in your right hand. Go up there and dial your grip. So take a look up there. Okay. That's where I want you to look. Right. Bend that a bit so you can reach it when you put your left hand up there. Okay. There you go. See what I'm saying? Okay. And now take a look at the face. There we go. That's fantastic. Three, two, one. Miss it. Or not. Good. Way to go. Do it again. Well, you know, I mean, it's like when you do this, if you're too flat, and then you look at a ball, you have to tumble onto it, don't you? So go ahead and grip it. So bend your right arm so it's not so far you can't you can't get it. Yeah, look at your face. Dial it a bit. Okay? Reach up there. Grab it. Okay? Get your shoulders pitchy. You know what I mean? Look at the ball. Three, two, one. Hit it. Okay, good. Check it out, though. See, to me, like, I think this would be great homework for you. 
Like, look at that guy. Yeah. That looks like some guy on tour. Right? That is, that's what a golf swing should look like. You know, and the face on, let's see, yeah, that's, that's really good. That's some dude who plays for a living. Okay? That's very organized compared to this. I hate even showing you this. Right? Because I, right? Because it's like, good luck finding, fixing this. Because a club, now this athlete of you somehow manages to get the damn club on it. It's like, yeah, like yesterday, I mean, I worked my way. I didn't get in a lot of trouble. And yeah. Ended up shooting 41, 41. And the, right. But it could have been, I, yeah, it just could have been. You know, so this tumble, this, even from here, it kind of tumbles a little out to where you're going to kind of miss hit it, right? So even as good as this is, how does that left screen get just right. amazing? I'll show yeah. you. Okay, so that left screen gets amazing by kind of understanding that you don't need so much of the tumble of the sweet spot, you know, onto the ball this way. Okay, the, the sensation would be, okay, so you got the club here. This is how you dial a grip. Okay, ladies club champ in Reno. Lisa Stanley, hope you're doing well. Okay, up here, you know. Not 90, but, you know, a little obtuse, but nothing acute, and, right? And dial your grip, right? So, and your shoulders down. Don't put it so far away you can't reach it. Get hold of it. Okay, there's Whitey. You know, get, you know, try to get the club on there. See what I'm saying? Buddy, all, you, all you're doing is trying to futz. You're trying to cor correct stuff from a messed up face. That is related to every compensatory move you make. Totally. So if we go, you know, if we say, okay, we're going to do this. We're going to hold it on the steel up here a little bit. Make sure we know where the face is. Okay. Take a half step that way for me. There you go. Perfect, right? And you're going to have your left shoulder down. And you're going to, okay. There we go. That's a nice left, nice and comfy left hand, flattish left hand. Build your grip, right? Look at the golf ball. Now, you still had a little bit of a, I don't trust it, tumble. You know, there's got to be just a little bit of a way toward the scotch bottle. Right? So I know it feels casty. A lot of club golfers want this idea of lag. Rubbish. Never. Okay? The good players... Here's your leg. This isn't this isn't your leg. There's your shoot 90. Okay, so that's here's leg, bud. Okay, that's leg. But when I watch this, is there really a big angle in there? No. Right? It's all it's all an illusion. So when you watch a golfer like Sergio do this, right? Look at the TV. And he shallows. That looks like it got extremely laggy, didn't it? But it doesn't. It's not. It's not. It's nothing to do with the club getting jackknifing toward me. So that illusion buggers up more damn golfers. What you did at the top, that's freaking amazing. That's the look you need. Do it again. Okay. So right, yep, take it. Even hold it half on the steel, though. Okay, good, yeah. Bend, more bend, more bend, more bend, more bend. Good, left shoulder down. Good, figure out a way to get a peaceful, flat, flattish left hand on there. Awesome, okay. Look, look down at a golf ball. Okay, hit it. Good, let's have a look. So there, you, there again looks fantastic. Yeah, no, that's that. That's the last one. Okay, I just took a back view of it. Wide right arm. See what I mean? Not way over hinged. It's that's awesome. Okay. See what I'm saying? So now it still tumbles a bit, but boy, is that better. 
and I know you missed, so it wasn't pleasing, right? And you're just kind of tipping it outside where you need to go, right? It just needs to get away from you more. When I say away from you, I mean as this as this circle starts to work its way down to the, oops, starts that circle starts to work its way down to the ball, right? This shaft has to flee away from you. It has to start to go this way. You know, it has to get out. As soon as it gets out, the rotation squares it. You're trying to you're trying to tumble it square with hand. You're trying to get the thing square this way, like you know, getting it tumbly that way. And you don't need to. Like that's perfect. Yeah, because if you just keep going, you're golden, right? Like, that's gorgeous. But you're just twisting it over the top of it and move it sh and just shifting it enough to check hit it on the neck. Okay, so you know summary of this. It, as a you know, I guess a really good coach would figure this out in five minutes. But you know, I've been doing this 35 years now, and maybe one day I'll be really good at it. But the but the point is. You know, looking at you and watching like how this stuff kind of goes from kind of a strongish grip, kind of a, I don't even know, kind of a funky looking right hand, and then it got into here somehow, and then now it's like from here, I don't even know how you hit, how hit it with reliability, but you did because you're a good athlete, right? So, you know, for you to go, okay, how do I kind of go, okay, there, okay, cool, all right. You get my point? Build it, come back here, don't futz with it, hit it. Next step, go. You can take the power click off. I think you know what I'm what your left wrist needs to do there. We'll do more of that tomorrow. So now the next step, right? Build it up there, go back to the ball for a second, and then hit one. Does that make sense? Yeah, bend the right arm more. Okay, reach up, grab it. Soft, flattish left hand. Dial in that club face. Okay, and I go to the ball. Don't hit it. Don't hit it. Go to the ball. Set up to the ball. Good. Now, ah, see, you, you regripped it though. You're not allowed to. You're not allowed to get comfortable. You're not allowed to come back here and go like this, right? Like once you build it here and you dial a face in and you got your flattish wrist and your right hand supporting that thumb, come back to the ball. When you come back to the ball, right? You're you're up here. You build it. Okay. You can't go here and then this. No. Build it, dial a face, left hand, right hand, to the ball, and then start. Go to the ball, hit it. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we tw twisted it about. I think you did twist it, actually. Where did I twist it? At the we'll see. Okay. We'll see. Because we know that you can build this pretty easy. Let's see, you know that one. This one. You've done this a couple times in a row, okay, where you've built a fantastic top of backswing, right? So over here, this t takes a different clip timing. So you came back to the ball, okay? Not as good, but not bad. You see what I mean? But not as, yeah, shoulder's not down enough, is it? Okay, much better though. Way to go, bud. That's way better. You got you got half a chance from there. You see what I'm saying? Okay, but that was way better. Way, way to go. That was awesome. Okay, so hold it, cash, hold the club a foot off the ground so you can just hold it on the steel, right? Bend your right arm, dial in the face. Like... Even even twist it about so you really feel like you're dialing it in. Okay? Good. Now grip it with the left hand. Cuddle it with the right hand. Okay? And then go back to the golf ball without futzing around. Uh uh uh. But whoa, whoa, whoa. So see this thumb and the index finger and stuff? So sh yeah, watch. Right? See what I'm saying? It's not. Yeah, so there's me dialing it around with good right hand. You know, getting pitched, you know, peaceful left, the trigger finger, you can slow down here, restful thumb, casually come back to the ball, and then hit it. Come on!
Oh, shit, I triggered the impact trigger. Hold on. Let it... Okay. Good, hit it. Nice. Good. I think that's how your, your routine's going to be when we go farther around on the course. If you want to join us. Yeah. Okay. Right. And there'll be a point where you don't have to do that, where you don't have to go through this event. Like Lisa, the gal who's a, a very good golfer, setup looks great, hands look. So this is you as you came back to the ball, right? Nobody knows that except you, right? Hands look much better, still strong-ish. Yeah, that's way better. Check it out. Check this out. This guy. Where'd this guy go here? Yeah, it's way better. This guy, I mean, oi, right here, right? You know what I mean? Like, not even close. Sure. Way better. Way, way, way better. Uh, awesome. 